please subscribe to Face TV Africa and turn the notification on. Face TV Africa, Ejo, e subscribe, subscribe, eh, hete. Face TV. Uswobi. Uh, basically, uh, we arrested some illegal miners, some Chinese national. Uh, we got uh, some credible uh, intelligence and then we've been on uh, surveillance for a while and then we were able to uh, move in and then uh, we have them with us. And uh, we, we are ensuring that the due processes of the law uh, is, is followed by creation of law, so we follow strictly uh, the law. Uh, recall last week, uh, the acting chairman was talking about uh, the dangers of uh, illegal mining uh, in one of the trainings that we had. Uh, and uh, you, you see, this is exactly what uh, it, it is. There are 13 in number, uh, a female and 12 uh, male. Uh, they were arrested, like I said, for illegal mining. And they were mining in areas where they didn't have license to. Uh, and they were also uh, into uh, mining stones for quarry. Uh, they also breached the provisions of the Money Laundering Act. Uh, they don't have a SCUMO certificate. They're not registered with SCUMO. Uh, they don't pay royalty. There's no evidence of uh, payment of royalty. Uh, other issues are also being handled by immigration, uh, you know, a sister agency. Uh, so we're collaborating. Uh, there, there are certain things that are expected to have met uh, in terms of the law before coming into the country. Uh, of, of the 13 we arrested, we only five have, a, have their passport. The other uh, Remaining of them don't have passports with them. Uh, but uh, we, we are also bringing the immigration to look at uh, that aspect. Nigeria is the only country that we have, uh, so we must protect everything that we have. Illegal mining uh, comes with so much danger. You know, there's the, the part of insecurity uh, that this could lead to, especially in states like this. We see what is happening in Zamfara and other places, uh, in Nasarawa and the other places. As we're trying to also see uh, EFCC how we can give our best to ensure that uh, that sector is sanitized so that legal miners only can take over the minings in this country. Well, they were arrested yesterday, early morning, like I said, after uh, a, a long trailing and uh, deep intelligence, very detailed intelligence, yesterday they were arrested. And uh, the law is taking its course. Uh, we're, like I said, we're creation of law, we're following strictly uh, the provisions of the law. Uh, after investigation, they're going to be arraigned in court. Don't forget, this is not the first time we are arranging, uh, arresting uh, uh, a Chinese national. One Jiang uh, was uh, arrested sometime last year. He was eventually convicted. Uh, and then, uh, so we, we will follow the same uh, process they are here. Uh, so, and of course, the law uh, is keeping them here. So, yes, we're working on all of that because we know that they won't just step in here. Uh, alone, they're foreigners, uh, so we're, we're, we're asking questions. Who brought you? What did you come for? How did you get in here? You don't have passports. How did you? How were you able to come in here? Give us the remaining of your passport. We can see five and all of that. We want to have the other. So we're we're we're, we're broad. We're deep. We're going far. Yes, it's a detailed investigation, uh, and uh, thereafter, uh, we're in them in court. Please subscribe to Face TV Africa and turn the notification on. Face TV Africa, and your subscribe, subscribe, and hit it. Face TV. Oswobi.